An Angry Elephant on the Run. A macaw goes missing from the zoo, and look where it's found. Anything like, <laughs> let the man work. What are you doing? Why are you oh, she's looking at her. Oh my god, it has a branch on it. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, it's Rainier. Rainier. Oh, he got a snack now. Friends are still out there somewhere and just peaced out. Off. And we were like, why? <laughs> they, they know the whole area of Roger Williams Park. They're, they're A diver plays with an octopus. And Orca comes in to say hello. <laughs> Don't you put your hand in his mouth. Well, I can't put my head there, can I? <laughs> hello. This is Boca the Bobcat. That looks like some good eats for a bobcat. You ready? You want it? Let's go. Come on. Outside. You ready? You ready? Here it is. There you go. Look at the size of this anaconda. An interesting encounter between a rooster and a dog. intimate moment with a hawk. A man up close with the most dangerous animal in Africa. I love my baby. I love my baby. I love my baby. I love my girl. I love Molly. This falcon is adorable.
a wild hippo appears to be friendly. This rhino walking the streets of India. So go ahead, Allah. Allah, if you duplicate, go ahead, Allah. No, no, no. Hey, full khala daga, Allah. Isara. Ab answer kya hai? Let's knock kali go ahead, Allah. Imagine a wild hippo joining you at the dinner table. There's a fantastic bond I've never had with any other animal my whole life. I've raised elephants and buffalo and lions and that stuff. And I've never had something this close. Never ever. Jessica spends her days lazing in the sun and cooling down in the water with Tony and his wife on hand to deliver refreshment. That's what she is. That is what she is to us. And how do you see her? I see Jessica as my daughter, 100% she. I can't imagine my life without this. And Jessica seems happy, and after a long, hard day of eating, she likes a massage before she goes to bed. Hippos live into their 40s, and Jessica is expected to mate and breed. So there could soon be another hefty pet here, curling up with the dogs to go to sleep. Emma Heard, Sky News, Hood Spray, South Africa. A protective giant schnauzer looking after a little girl at the beach. She's not gonna let you go out that far. You okay? Yeah. All right. Don't go that far out, Aureli. Don't keep pushing it. Don't keep pushing it, because you'll get dizzy. Here. There you go. You gotta relax, okay? When you get tired and dizzy, you can't stay out in the water like that. <laughs> a man tames a wild mouse. An up close and friendly encounter with a mountain goat. I'm talking to the goat. What? I'm talking to the goat. Oh. He's licking the salt off my arm. Yeah. That's one friendly goat. Okay, that's enough. Chilling with wild rats. Yes. Really quite sociable. They're very easily startled though, both of them. I've only got two left now. Uh, one of them died. One of the four rats I found uh, 
in the Pop-Ops Beaver died very shortly after I found them and the other one died a couple of weeks later. Very easily startled though, so I suspect that they're always going to have a bit of a wild streak. Real escape artists. A turkey is not something you would think would be aggressive towards you. I don't know if turkeys hurt people. Look, he will not let me back in my truck. There is something extra creepy about a snake climbing a tree. A man shows how to catch and bag a wild python. Okay, so what would you do now? Since he's moving away, what I want to do is take the butt end of my hook, I'm going to pin his head, and if you notice, he starts pulling his head back. Now he's getting a little upset. And if they coil around you, it's not a big deal. Unless it's your neck. Unless it's your neck, and let it be your hands. And show us again, me close up, how you hold it. Put it over his head. And in most cases, they'll start to crawl into the bag to try and get away from you. And then you can assist a little bit and speed it up. How fun would this be? The nightmare inducing bird eating spider. Finally, let me pick him up without flicking hairs on me. This is a Goliath bird eating tarantula, the largest species of. He's finally gained my trust. And it's been, and this is the. He's only been in the cage for 24 hours. She's been in the cage for 24 hours. Folks, this is not a domestic dog. This is actually a dingo, which is a wild dog native of Australia. <coughs> this ostrich has a lot of personality. The world's most dangerous bird, the cassowary. Just a few of these could take down a human easily. This is the Asian giant hornet. An ostrich on the run. A curious bee comes in for a close-up.
Θέλω να τα κουμπίσεις. Να κουμπίσε το. Δεν σε πειράζει. Έλα. This is something on my bucket list. Σε λάγει να τρώω τα βί. Taking down an annoying hornet's nest. Jeff Corwin chilling with a huge harpy eagle. Most wildlife biologists in this part of the world, this is the greatest New World raptor. It is extraordinary. It certainly is the largest eagle you're going to find in the New World. It's the harpy eagle. You're probably wondering, how did I end up with this harpy eagle on my arm? We certainly didn't track it in the wild. In fact, this individual, along with some other harpies and other raptors, are part of a very important conservation program here in Panama, as well as the rest of the world, the Peregrine Fund. And they specialize in the conservation of raptors. A woman with a very lovely and unorthodox pet. It's Billy Gotti the goat. He's the most stylish animal you probably could ever meet. Because my son stay fresh. He stay fresh. He's also pretty famous too with more than 50,000 followers on Instagram and 80,000 likes on Facebook. The woman holding Billy in this Instagram live video is Jolie Shine. She made social media pages for the goat with tons of videos showing their daily shenanigans. Each post has thousands and thousands of shares. From Africa, Haiti, UK, I think I was in Ireland. For one reason or another, people just can't get enough of the two. One Instagram user said, this is my new favorite Instagram account. Another said, OMG, I love him. This is too cute. Then it all just went everywhere. This was not intentional. It just happened. This all started because Jolie says she was lonely. She doesn't have any kids, so she thought, why not buy a goat? I was raised on the farm. We had cows, we had pigs. So one day I just started looking up goats. Now she considers Billy to be her child. He's such a good baby. Jolie takes him along with her when she runs errands, like when she needs to go to the store. He goes everywhere with me. Everywhere. This isn't all just for follows, likes, or shares. Give up, kiss, Billy. Billy makes people feel good too. Here's a Facebook video of the goat visiting and sharing love with someone at a retirement home. Anywhere he actually goes, like we actually was here at the park, and the kids absolutely love him. Speed it up, 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 speed it up.